In this video, we will try to learn how to find the marginal productivity of capital and labor from the given production function. The question is like this. Find the marginal productivities of capital and labor if production function is given. That is Q is equal to 10K minus K square plus KL where K is capital L is labor when uh, the value of K is 2 units and L is 6 units. We need to find the MPK and MPL. Okay. Now, what is our production function? We have Q is equal to 10K minus K square uh, plus KL. Okay. Let me write here KL. This is our production function. Now, what is marginal uh, productivity of labor? Marginal uh, productivity of, first we will find the marginal productivity of capital. Marginal productivity of capital is given by the partial derivative of production function with respect to capital will give us the uh, marginal productivity of capital okay so we need to differentiate uh, this production function partially with respect to capital here okay the derivative of k is 1 so we are left with 10 minus the derivative of k square will be 2k this 2 will become coefficient and this exponent will be subtracted by 1 so 2 minus 1 will be 1 so we have 2k uh, plus the derivative of k will be here 1 so we are left with l okay this is our marginal productivity of capital now what is marginal productivity of marginal productivity of capital when when we have k is equal to k is equal to 2 and l is equal to okay we just need to plug the values of k and l here so we have 10 minus 2 the value of k is 2 minus we have l the value of l is 6 okay so this will come out to be a uh, sorry it is here plus so 10 plus uh, 6 is 16 16 minus 4 is 12 so we got marginal productivity of capital is 12 now what is marginal productivity of labor similarly we have take we have to take partial derivative of production function with respect to l will give us the marginal productivity of labor okay so let's differentiate this with respect to l since no l is involved in first term and in the second term so we are left with third term the derivative of l is one here so we are left with k okay now what is uh, m p l when uh, k is equal to 2 and l is equal to 6 okay so we just need to plug the value of k and l in this equation since no l is involved here so we have only k so we can get the value of k is equal to 2 just plug here so we get here 2 okay that means we got marginal productivity of labor is equal to 2 and marginal productivity of capital is equal to 12 okay I hope I make myself clear in this video. If you like, if you like these videos, please share and subscribe with your econ uh, friends. Thank you.